A total of eight people in Massachusetts have now tested positive for the coronavirus. Still only one confirmed case with seven presumptive positive cases. Those cases need to be confirmed by the CDC. Now, of the eight cases, four are in Boston, three are in Norfolk County, and one is in Middlesex County. Most of these new cases are connected to a Biogen conference that took place in Boston, and one of the new cases is a parent that we've learned about in Wellesley, who, whose kids attend schools in town, and those schools closed early today out of an abundance of caution. Our Paul Burton is there now. So, Paul, what can you tell us? Well, the students were dismissed here around noontime here at the Wellesley Middle School. All of them were very much aware of the situation, and some were very concerned as to what this all means. An email went out this morning to all the parents, teachers, and staff at both the Upham Elementary School and the Wellesley Middle School saying they were dismissing all the students early after a parent of children at those two schools has coronavirus. It's important to note that the kids of that parent are showing no signs or symptoms of the virus. But out of abundance of caution, they made the decision to release all the students so they can clean and sanitize those buildings. Students we spoke with are happy that the school department is taking all the necessary steps to protect everyone. There's so many people in the school and like we don't know who it is and we could I could it could just be one of my friends that I'm like talking to right now and it's just it's really scary. People are fear mongering and it's mm -hmm. scaring people and kids and it's completely unnecessary. And school officials say that they're working closely with the Wellesley Health Department. All the other schools, public schools here in Wellesley are on a regular schedule and being, being dismissed on time. In Wellesley, I'm Paul Burton, CBS in Boston.